your question is the diagram showed a solid formed by joining a hemisphere of radius r centimeter to a cylinder of radius r centimeter and height is h centimeter the total height of the solid is 18 centimeter and the surface area is 205 pi centimeter square find the value of r and value of h now we can understand this what is that this is your solid full solid is there no hollow they have told see this solid form by joining this is your hemisphere this is your cylinder now they have given the radius r both hemisphere and cylinder is r <coughs> height of the cylinder is h total height is 18 if we, if you can see this is your r that means this is your also r radius now and this is also radius this one dotted line yes it's also radius that means total height is r plus h so now we can write r plus h is equal to 18 cm now take anything anything so now we will take r r is equal to we can say 18 minus h now go go on for a second that surface area so how we will find out the surface area cylinder plus hemisphere now you they have told that is solid solid formed solid formed if you see cylinder cylinder contains what this that means curved surface area of the cylinder csa of cylinder plus now this is one circle that means area of a circle plus this is what csa of a hemisphere now we will put the formula what we will get csa of a cylinder is what 2 pi rh plus area of a circle is pi r square plus csa of a hemisphere is what csa of a hemisphere is what 2 pi r square now if you see pi is common and r is also common so we will write pi and r is common what we will get here 2h plus here you will get r and here what you will get 2r what they have given this is equal to 205 pi so we will write that only pi r into 2h plus r plus 2r is 3r that is equal to 205 pi now you can see pi and pi go hmm? hmm now we will substitute 18 minus h here where r is there so you will get 18 minus h and here we will get 2h plus 3 into 18 minus h this is equal to 205 now just we will try to solve this we will get 18 minus h into 2h plus 3 into 18 is what 
फिफ्टी फोर माइनस थ्री एच दैट इज इक्वल टू टू जीरो पॉइंट नाउ सॉल्व दिस टू एच माइनस थ्री एच इज माइनस एच तो वी विल गेट एटीन माइनस एच एंड हियर यू विल गेट फिफ्टी फोर माइनस एच दैट इज इक्वल टू टू जीरो पॉइंट नाउ सॉल्व दिस एटीन इंटू फिफ्टी फोर इज वॉट दैट वी विल राइट फिफ्टी फोर एंड एटीन एट फोर दर्टी टू थ्री कैरी एट इंटू फाइव फोर्टी फोर्टी थ्री फोर फाइव यू विल गेट टू सेवन एंड नाइन नाइन सेवेंटी टू यर यू विल गेट नाइन सेवेंटी टू then minus 18h minus 54h plus h square that is equal to 205 now bring everything to your left side and try to solve it first we will take h square so you will get what h square then minus 18 minus 54 is what minus 84 is 12 One carry six, one is seven. Seventy two h. Then nine seventy two minus two zero five. This you will have to bring this side. You will get minus two zero five. So what you will get? Two minus five is seven. Then six. Then nine minus two is. Seven seven sixty seven. That is equal to now. Now we will go for a quadratic formula. What is your quadratic formula? That we will write here. H is there, so we will write H. H is equal to minus b plus minus root over b square minus four ac by two a. Now substitute the value. What you will get? We will get h is equal to minus p. That means minus of minus seventy two is seventy two plus minus root under seventy two square. B square is minus seventy two square minus four into seven sixty seven by two two a a is one. Now, if you solve this, you will get seventy-two plus minus root over now seventy-two square is five one eight four minus now four into seven sixty-seven is three zero six eight by two. What we will get? We will get seventy-two plus minus root over, and here it comes to root over. What is that? If you minus it, you will get what six one one two two one one six two one one six is a perfect square of forty-six. So we will write that only seventy-two plus minus forty-six divided by two. Now you have to take one time positive, one time negative. So what we will get? Now we can say h is equal to. First we will take positive one. So we will tell seventy-two plus six is what? Seventy-two plus six. No, two plus six is eight, and four plus seven is eleven by two. That is equal to we can say it's a five nine fifty nine. If you take positive, it will be fifty nine. Next, we will take minus. If you take minus. Twelve minus six is six. Six, six minus four is two. 
26 by 2 that is equal to 30. Now you can see the total height is 18 centimeter only total height of the solid but we got the height of the cylinder is what 59. So that means we will not take this one. We will take only 13. 13 centimeter is the height of the cylinder. 13. Then what is the radius? You will get R is equal to 18 minus H. That means what? 18 minus 13. This is equal to 18 minus 13. That is equal to 5 centimeter. Now we can say radius is 5 centimeter and height is 13 centimeter.